this is Minecraft Skyblock Hardcore, where we are stranded on a block above the void. With nothing but a few items, we have to make our way in this world, collecting what we can and building up the world. Welcome to episode three, everyone. Hello, everyone. Things are very organized around here. I'm proud of us. We got tree farms, farm farms, and even a mob farm. Speaking of which, the mob farm is going extremely well. I even managed to get a second iron ingot recently. So now we're up to two and one piece of redstone. Oh, thunder. So everyone, we have today's main objective. We need to get dirt. Dirt is extremely important, okay? Normally, I know the dirt is pretty worthless, but we've only got a very limited amount, just what's on our island currently and the little bits that we can scrape up from the surrounding islands, which is not gonna be enough for the mass farming that I wanna do. Now I have to warn you, this is gonna require some risk. I'm sure it'll be totally fine though. I'm just gonna build us a little nether portal, very carefully, right here. Don't mess it up, don't mess it up. Okay, nailed it. Now, all we need is for this wood to catch on fire. Simple, right? Something tells me this is gonna take a while. That's okay, I got time. I will farm the mobs. Come here, my precious. Yes. Okay, nothing yet. It's all good. I'll just farm some of the crops while I wait. Oh yeah, this is satisfying. <gasps> it worked! Hey, perfect, good job, Lava. That wasn't so bad at all. Now, I'm just gonna stock up on a little bit of cobblestone for this next step. Make a couple of those in the slabs. There we go. Oh, and some more food. Thank you, thank you. I've also got my bow and some arrows on me, just in case we get into trouble. Okay, we're gonna go in the nether on Skyblock Hardcore. We have no armor and no good tools, but we have some cobblestone and some wood and some sweet berries and a bow and a dream. We need dirt and we're gonna get it in the nether. So let me break this down for you. We're going into the nether because we need gravel. Gravel becomes coarse dirt, which becomes regular dirt, which allows us to get infinite dirt. The only way we can do that though is with a gold farm and piglin bartering. So this might be a little risky. Well, here goes nothing. It's gonna be fine, I'm sure. Oh boy. Okay, this is totally fine. I'm fine. Why didn't I make any torches? I Hold on, I make some torches. We're gonna need a little nether base. Buttons so that things don't spawn. I am so scared right now. <laughs> oh, nether, please be merciful. Okay, I've got some torches now, so that's a, a bit better, hopefully. Oh, there's a chest! One fire charge, okay. I'm highly assuming that is so that we can relight this portal if they go out, which is good. I'm gonna leave that in the chest, I'm gonna leave it alone. I'm not gonna touch it, it's all good. Okay, so as you can see, the nether is also a skyblock, but a nether version of a skyblock. Okay, so here's what's gotta happen. I gotta create a platform where things can spawn so that I can kill them to get the things that I need. The tricky part about that is that I actually do need to not die, so it's more complicated than you would think. My plan at the moment is to give ourselves this lovely little walkway right here and then create a little spawn platform out there. Out of full blocks, of course, because that's what's gonna allow things to spawn. I'm starting us off with a very tiny test version because I don't trust myself. Okay, we've got a platform. We're gonna give it a test run. <gasps> there we go! We got our first nether mob. Okay, and then I should just be able to run up here and hit it. And they can't hit me, and I can hit them. Oh! I did it! And then we just crawl in there, we grab that. Oh my gosh, I got my first gold! <laughs> that was easy, actually. Now, I don't know if I need to state the obvious here, but this is obviously not a gold farm, but it'll do. Come on, guys, give me a gold. No gold? A little bit of gold. Thank you. Right, proof of concept is definitely there. Now, all I've gotta do is go back into the overworld and expand on this. And by expand on it, I mean we're going to have to farm a lot more cobble, but that's okay. Five hours later. <gasps> There we go, it's our first piglin. Okay, now, this is important. You take that, and that. Yeah, you like that? What do you got, what do you got? Leather! 
Okay, that's cool. I like leather. My plan is I really need one of these guys to be in a box. I can't imagine this not sucking. Um, I'm thinking this guy will have a very strong desire to come murder me. I'm banking on it, actually. Oh, dear. I'm fine. This is fine. This is what I intended to happen. Yeah, yeah, this was intentional. What are you doing, buddy? Oh, dear. I have made a terrible, terrible mistake. Hey, buddy. Do you know what? That actually didn't go that badly. That actually was totally fine. So now we just have 20 more problems. Luckily, I'm known for my archery skills. Okay, got it. Okay, are the rest of these guys neutral? You guys zombified? And I'm only up to so far one mistake on my stupid mistake counter, so I feel like that's pretty good for me. Okay, and now I think I'm safe. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, okay, this is so good. Now have you despawned? We're up to two on the fatal stupid mistake counter. Two. Okay, so on account of my last plan being, well, dumb, I'm gonna go with a plan B, which is gonna be a lot cleaner. We're just gonna use a boat. I am trying very hard right now to use my brain in a very big way. Okay, I'm fairly certain that this time my plan is foolproof. Can I shoot him? Oh, I can shoot him. Please? Yes. Okay. That kind of worked. Can you get in the boat, please? <gasps> Are you in the boat? Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Mission accomplished. We are saved. You are in the boat. That is so good. Thank you so much. So that means that this guy can no longer despawn, and we should be able to just chuck him gold. Yeah, you look at that. And give me something. Crying Obsidian. It's foolproof, really. I only, what, two stupid mistakes? Three, maybe? I'd count that as a win, to be honest. Now, importantly, we have to go out of our way to make sure nothing ever spawns on any of this, because that would be very dangerous for my well-being. But I think we're good, which means I can get some more gold. Okay, let's do this. I'm a little nervous that they're gonna be able to squeeze through this. Okay, if they can, I'll just run. Are we good? Oh, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one. Hey, buddy. Hey, I see you got a chicken. That's a nice chicken. Unfortunately, hostile mob chickens despawn. So unless we get two of you, you're no good. Perfect, one more ingot, trade it to the guy. What are we gonna name our guy? I feel like you look like a Gerald. Gerald, what do you got for us? String! That was a lot of string, nine string. Nice, okay, cool. What we really want, of course, is gravel, but just getting this process going and kind of getting into it is really important. So I'm spending some time doing that. I've been in here for quite a while now, as you can see by my 50 levels, and I've gotten up to five gold ingots. I've decided I'm gonna try to get eight so that we have at least one golden apple, and then we'll continue on to try to get some gravel. And just like that, we got our eight golden ingots, yes. I'm gonna put these very safely in this chest and then we'll see if we can get some more. Look at all this gold! Wait, there's two chickens! We got two chickens! Just gotta kill that guy, please. Yeah! Hey guys! What you doing? All right, come on guys. In you go. Oh, perfect. I actually think that worked. Oh, we have three? <laughs> okay. There we go. Make a child. Oh my gosh. I have a baby. You're a baby. I will make you a pen. Come on in. We have chickens. I'm getting a little sick of all my food sources, so I'm gonna cook some potatoes. I like potatoes. We got another baby. Oh, this is so good, actually. 
right. Well, uh, I think that's probably enough procrastinating with chickens. Thank you, chickens. You're very cute. I'm gonna go back in the nether now. Hello, everybody. Oh, we're still very angry. Okay. All right, Gerald, listen up. I got five ingots for you. Only the best. You're gonna give me some gravel, right? Some gravel. That's fine. Take your time. Okay, what was that? That was more fire resistance. I'll take it, but not quite. What was that? Iron! Oh, that's really useful. Listen, dude. I need gravel, please. Okay. This is gonna take a while. It's fine. I got all day. I just took the puppy to the beach. Oh, um, puppy tax. There you go. Puppy is doing absolutely fantastic, by the way. I am in a new outfit. It is a separate day. It is morning now, and I just took her to the beach. She had the greatest time. It was about zero degrees Celsius, so it's so cold, but she's loving it. Hey, dudes. What was that? Soul speed. Darn it, that's really good, but I don't need it. Ooh. Quartz. That's fun. That unlocks observers for us. The Minecraft grinder and collector in me really wants to do this page. This is a custom advancement page called Collector, where you have to get all of these different things, like every dye possible, every color of all those things, panes of glass, interior decorator, like there's all of these. For some reason, I really like the idea of trying to complete that. I've never been like a Minecraft advancement hunter, but that seems fun. <gasps> oh my gosh! We got gravel! I'm so excited! <laughs> and we got 12 gravel. Okay. Thank you. You are the best. You know that, Gerald? You're the absolute best. So I'm gonna take my gravel. I'm gonna take my eight gold. I'm gonna run for it. Okay, we have a lot of new items to look at. First of all, tons of rotten flesh, which is great. Also some leather, which wasn't really possible to get a lot of before. We've also got some iron, like a fair amount of iron. I think that was a pretty effective iron gathering session. We got three. We also got the soul speed book, potion of fire resistance, some spectral arrows, and some more crying obsidian, which is all fantastic. Now, let's get on to the main event, the dirt. Oh, and the chickens. Hello, chickens. Would you like some food? There you go. You're so cute. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, first order of business. Let's take our apple and combine it with our gold to get a golden apple. That'll be important in a moment. Next, let's go ahead and grab some of these bones. So we can grow this real quick and just, yep, perfect. So here's the plan. This 12 gravel that we have is going to become dirt through coarse dirt. We've just taken four dirt and we've made it eight dirt. And all we gotta do is till this and turn it into normal dirt. Ha, oh, it's lovely. And we can keep doing this, of course, until we run out of gravel, which we did. We just went from five dirt to 17 dirt. I love Skyblock. I'm gonna actually go ahead and use some of that extra dirt to start a sugarcane farm. It's got a long way to go yet, of course, but this is a great first step. Okay, farming aside, it's time to move on to our next objective, the golden apple. The golden apple is obviously to make a villager. However, we would need a zombie villager for that and we would need a weakness potion. So, a couple things. We could go back to the nether, find a blaze island, defeat the blaze, find the potion stuff you know, do all of that, or we could find a witch. Now, I'm no genius, but I think since we have the mob farm, a witch might be the easier way to go here. I may end up regretting this. You see, all of these fun, lovely little mobs in here, they all die pretty easy. And I think if we just take out this right here, they should die. Creepers really are just the bane of my existence. All right, it's fine. Everybody relax. Yeah. Farm is on auto kill, except it will not kill witches because witches are built different and they have a lot of health. Oh, I got another iron ingot, brilliant. Do you know what? Since we've got a couple of iron ingots now, I'm gonna go ahead and make our little hardcore safety net a shield. Normally on Skyblock, I probably would never build a shield, but I need to not die. So that'll probably help. 
Now, while we are patiently waiting for a witch to spawn, the other very important thing that we definitely need is a zombie villager. So we're gonna just go out here and um, hold on. I need this to be full block. Hello, thank you. Oh, that's a witch. I hear a witch. Hi, ma'am. I'm gonna put you in this boat, okay? Come on. Into the boat? Oh, yep, that was slowness. Okay, the witch is in the boat. Yep, yep, I'm fine. This is fine. Okay, this might be a really dumb thing to do, but anyways, I've done it now. Oh, there we go, we got a regular zombie. Sorry, dude, you're not exactly what I wanted. Well, we got half of what we needed on night one. We got the witch. She'll get over it. It's fine. She works for us now. Her name's gonna be Janice. Janice the witch. And since the sun is up, we're not gonna get a zombie villager right now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and continue my farming. I could do with some more baked potatoes anyways, to be honest. Chickens, we are once again prepared to start the zombie watch. I'm feeling good about it. Tonight's the night. Oh, chick. And now we wait very patiently. I have good news and I have bad news. The bad news is it's been about two hours. This has not worked. So bad luck. The good news is I have a plan B. Now, I don't know why I didn't just do this from the start, but I'm gonna use the mob spawner. Just feels like this is already here. It's already more efficient. So we're gonna very carefully put back in the floor. That is unfortunately a regular zombie, but hey, Farm's working again. Look at that, we got some glowstone dust. This is, this is going well. Hello? Okay. Um, gosh. Why is everything always so hard? Can't have anything nice in Skyblock. It's gotta be a struggle. It's fine, I'll just uh, turn it off. Wow, still no zombie villager in there, so I guess really in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't matter. See, most people would act as though this is a crisis. However, I have had this happen to me almost every single time that I've played Skyblock. So at this point, it's just a routine. Now the witch is gonna add a little bit of an added challenge. But these, these mobs are still all one hits when they drop down. Hey, spider. How you doing? This villager better be the best villager that I've ever met when it spawns. 50 seconds of slowness. Come on, it's all bad enough. I feel like we've recovered that quite nicely. Oh my gosh, there is one. There is one. Okay, nobody panic. Hold on. Yep. Okay, I've stopped more mobs from falling down on him. Now I need to carefully weed out or everybody else. Oh, hey dude, we're gonna be best friends. You're probably not gonna be an armorer because uh, I don't, I'm not really there yet. If you could just get in the boat. Oh, okay, breathe. I have both of the things that I need. What else do I need? I need the apple, the apple. I'm also gonna go ahead and sleep because you know what wouldn't be fun right now? Phantoms. Now. Witch is there, guy is there. We have to be within three blocks of the witch and she will hopefully throw a poison or weakness or both. So we have to get that guy to not kill us, but get the witch to throw a potion at us. That was poison, okay. What was that? What is she throwing? <laughs> I feel like it's going way over my head. Come on, Janice, get it together. Right, Janice, I'm adding a little roof to help your aim. Ow, come on, that's also harming. I'm gonna die, no more harming. <laughs> I forgot for a second. I'm gonna uh, Google witches, hold on. As you can see here, 25% chance. We're unlucky today. Okay, Janice, this is the one. Poison me and then make me weak, please. Poison. Weakness, that's instant damage. Weakness, <gasps> that was weakness, that was weakness, that was weakness. Yeah, 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 yes, 
Oh, Janice! I knew you could do it. Janice, you might have to die now. That's awkward. <gasps> yes! The cure. Oh, buddy! You're instantly a fisherman. I have bad news. You're not going to be a fisherman. I have a much cooler purpose for you. Now, when you get a villager in Skyblock, Fisherman's not actually one of the bad ones because Fisherman can trade string. The other good one would be Fletcher for sticks or a Farmer. And I think I'm gonna go with Farmer. Although all of those options are very good. I've just got a ton of bones and a ton of crops. Hey dude, you wanna be a potato farmer? I guess the next order of business now is getting our friend here a new house. At the moment, it's not actually gonna be much of a home because I need to breed these villagers and uh, so they're just gonna have to live in there. Good news though, is I do have a bed for you. A bed and a job. What more could you ask for really? Perfect. You're a farmer. Oh, and that's actually a pretty good trade. I've got some carrots right here. here you go buddy, carrots. <laughs> very nice. Okay, we did our very first trade and got emeralds. Oh, that feels good. Guess all we need to do now is uh, fix this place. Nobody panic. I'm fixing the mob farm. We've got a little rudimentary gold farm. We've got our mob spawner back. And we've got our brand new friend over here. What should we name him? Yep, you know, I've been naming stuff all episode. You guys deserved it. If you made it this far in the episode, name the villager. Huh, and now we farm. Oh, and we can upgrade you. Okay, let's see, let's see. Pumpkins, no way. That's perfect. We gotta start growing those, okay. There you go, upgrade again. Oh my gosh, cookies, melons, and pumpkin pie. Oh, we finally have a food source. Yes, please. This is epic. I definitely need some more dirt though, but that's gonna take some time. So for now, everyone, I do believe that that is quite enough for one episode. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you liked what you saw here. Give me all your tips and tricks in the comments as usual, and uh, I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everyone.